Oh no. Nice big chair. So Spitfire reached out to us in Street Gamers because they wanted to offer uh, their fans a really unforgettable camp experience in a virtual environment. And after talking with them, we realized that we basically wanted the same thing for the campers. We wanted the same type of experience, which um, you know involves lots of playing Overwatch, obviously, lots of opportunities to meet and, and make friends with new people, and then uh, of course the opportunity to play alongside of and learn from their favorite uh, Spitfire players and coaching staff. We focus a lot on the kind of fundamentals that we believe here at Nerd Street and Camp Local Hosts and kind of bring those into the London Spitfire competitive Overwatch scene. I think a lot of the skills are very practical because we try to ask each player their goals and ask them how they want to reach those goals and ways that they can reach it, right? Hi, my name is Jack, otherwise known as Simba, uh, on the Overwatch ladder, and I recently did the London Spitfire Flight School. So the first day, and I mean most days to be fair, we would start at 10 a.m. with a scrim. We would then have a VOD review after that scrim, uh, and that would usually take up the first two hours of the day. Then we would quickly break for lunch. After lunch, we would speak to a guest speaker. So we had uh, the presence of Nookie on the first day, the uh, GM for London Spitfire, and that was super interesting to speak to her to figure out the ins and outs of uh, the workings of a GM, which I found super, super interesting as someone who is prying into the esports scene and trying to learn a lot more about that. So I get the recruitment mainly. Um, I like to be very involved in that process, like doing coach interviews, doing like load watching scrims and giving feedback to the players too. I do regular like meetings with the Overwatch League to give them feedback on, on things like the format and what we need as a team. and. Um, how how we could implement like positive changes for the current situation and stuff, and I and I have to do these really weird content pieces where my cat jumps into my lap while I'm recording. <laughs> uh, my favorite moment of the camp it has to be. Uh, we managed to get some scrims in with some of the members of the London Spitfire. So that meant that I got to play Reinhardt against Had, the main tank for the London Spitfire this year. And let me tell you, I was nervous. I went into it, I was shaking, but the moment I landed a shatter on Hadi, an owl player was the best feeling ever. And to be honest, I think a lot of it uh, was just that the environment was so much fun. Everyone was having a laugh, but we were also taking the scrim super seriously because there was, uh, I suppose, reputation points on the line. So that has to be my favorite moment of the camp. We really just hope that campers walk away having a, a really great experience. Um, hopefully they've made some new friends, they've become better Overwatch players and more well-rounded players as well. And uh, of course that they got to interact with and have fun alongside of their idols. As far as what I would tell someone who is thinking of signing up, uh, prepare to work hard, prepare to meet some new cool people, prepare to be a little bit starstruck. Uh, you're going to have a bunch of fun and it's going to be an experience like no other.